After the triumphant release of The Equalizer 3, esteemed director Antoine Fuqua has set his sights on another captivating cinematic endeavor, the life of the legendary Michael Jackson. Earlier this year, it was officially confirmed that Fuqua would helm Michael, an eagerly anticipated biopic developed in collaboration with the Jackson estate. The film is poised to delve into the highs and lows of Jackson's life, culminating in his untimely passing in 2009. In a recent interview with Entertainment Weekly, Fuqua tantalizingly teased Michael and showered praise upon the film's lead, Jafar Jackson, coincidentally the real-life nephew of the King of Pop himself. Fuqua marveled at the uncanny resemblance Jafar shares with Michael, noting his remarkable ability to replicate his uncle's voice, dance moves, and singing prowess. It's uncanny how much he's like Michael, Fuqua marveled. Sounds like him, dances like him, sings. It's really uncanny. Graham King, who is a fantastic producer, found him and introduced him to me and I was blown away. Regarding the film's thematic angle, Fuqua emphasized the intention to present an unvarnished portrayal of the artist and the man behind the legend. He stressed the importance of conveying the full spectrum of Michael's life, embracing both his accomplishments and controversies with honesty. Just to tell the facts as we know it, about the artist, about the man, about the human being, Fuqua asserted. You know, the good, bad, and the ugly. Michael promises to offer audiences an unprecedented and comprehensive glimpse into the multifaceted life of the enigmatic figure who ascended to the title of King of Pop. The film is set to explore every facet of Michael's existence, from his iconic performance that solidified his status as the greatest entertainer of all time to the complexities of his personal journey. Michael has been in development since Graham King acquired the rights in late 2019 and is scheduled to commence principal photography once the ongoing WGA and SAG AFTRA Hollywood strikes conclude. The screenplay is penned by John Logan, renowned for his work on Gladiator and The Aviator. In response to Fuqua's involvement, Lionsgate Motion Picture Group chair Joe Drake expressed confidence in the director's ability to craft an unforgettable film, praising his storytelling prowess and dedication to the craft. Antoine is a perceptive and powerful filmmaker, and we feel very fortunate that he has chosen Michael as his next project, Drake stated. His visionary storytelling skills and commitment to his craft will make Michael an unforgettable film. For Fuqua, this project holds a special place, as he began his career directing music videos, profoundly influenced by Michael's groundbreaking work. The first films of my career were music videos, and I still feel that combining film and music are a deep part of who I am, Fuqua shared. For me, there is no artist with the power, the charisma, and the sheer musical genius of Michael Jackson. I was influenced to make music videos by watching his work, the first black artist to play in heavy rotation on MTV. His music and those images are part of my worldview, and the chance to tell his story on the screen alongside his music was irresistible. Producer Graham King echoed this sentiment, emphasizing Fuqua's unique ability to capture the essence of larger-than-life characters and enthrall global audiences. Antoine's films provide personal perspectives of larger-than-life characters that continuously captivate global audiences, King noted. I'm confident that Antoine will make an exceptional and compelling film that will both celebrate and give profound new insights into the life of the King of Pop. As the project Michael unfolds, it promises to be a cinematic journey that pays tribute to the unparalleled legacy of Michael Jackson while shedding light on the man behind the music. The film's blend of authenticity, talent, and a director's passion for storytelling paints a promising picture of what lies ahead for audiences eager to revisit the extraordinary life of the King of Pop. Close till I get up. So-